Hello and welcome uh, to the chart of uh, account setup. Uh, in this video, we will see uh, how the chart of accounts is set up in uh, in Oracle. So, chart of accounts is a uh, 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 basically uh, it's the accounting structure that you set up uh, in in an Oracle implementation in a in, a, in an organization. Uh, this is one of the most important setup in uh, financial setups, Oracle financial setups. Uh, the key steps uh, I have listed down here, like uh, step one, you have to decide on number and names of segments uh, in the chart of accounts. Then you define value sets. Then you define the chart of account structure based upon step one. Then you define the segments of for the account in K KFF keep expert and then you attach the value sets to the KFS segments and at the end we will see uh, defining the values uh, of the setup uh, of the defined KFS segments so step one the step one for chart of account setup this is a very important uh, step uh, to decide how your accounting structure would be for any oracle financial implementation in any company this is the most important uh, step you need to have clearly you need to find out what are the accounting need of your company uh, so before you set up you uh, have a meeting with the, the financial team to find out what is the financial reporting structure that needs to be generated and you know uh, the level of uh, reporting needs to be done so based upon various needs and requirement you basically decide how many segments you need in your accounting structure now in this video we have uh, uh, we will show you uh, the chart of account uh, account uh, uh, definition set up setting up chart of accounts and we have considered five segments uh, five segments for the accounting accounting structure one is company first one is company then natural account third is the cost center and then location and final fifth one is the project segment now as part of the setup uh, the next step is to define the value sets of each of the segments in Oracle. So, before we do that, uh, I just wanted to reiterate on the prerequisites for the chart of accounting setup. Uh, as you can see in the steps, uh, you should be familiar with the value set definition, how to define and the concept of value sets in Oracle applications. And also you uh, should be aware of the concepts of uh, key flex field and how to define a key, key flex field in, in Oracle apps. Now coming to the value set definition, uh, I'll show you uh, uh, one uh, value set, uh, I'll just show you how to define it and rest of the value set you can define as shown here in, the, in this slide. So let's see how it is, uh, the value set is defined for the first segment that is company. We'll go, we go to the value set definition screen. I've already defined one here. All the uh, value set required value sets for the segments. You see, this is the IPL company. That's the one first uh, value set that's required for the first segment company. And here also, you need to be very careful and uh, basically finalize how your value set would be because once you save it you, do, you cannot change the value set definition so these are the the ad different attributes that i have uh, mentioned here for the value set and here is how you define the value set form and the other value sets as defined here as i have shown here in this slide i have defined those as well uh, here in apps this ipl account you can see it's upper a check and non hierarchical long list of values. Similarly, I have defined for cost center, location, and project. So, we are done with the value set definition. The next step is the accounting structure details. Now, in order to define the accounting structure detail, we go to the KFF segments uh, screen in Oracle applications we query we have to query for the accounting text fill KFF 
and then here also I have defined the, the accounting structure for this uh, chart of accounts I have named it as IPL accounting flexible as uh, mentioned here uh, here also uh, please note all the attributes that I have mentioned here so similarly I have defined here now the next step after defining the structure in this screen uh, here also one more thing uh, keynote uh, please make a note uh, of the segment separated that you need whether you want dash period or pipe or so this would be the separator between the five segments that we are going to define I have mentioned here dash so after defining the accounting structure we go to the next step that is to basically define the, the five different segments for the the accounting structure and then we'll attach the value sets that we defined in the first step here you can see the value sets here now we have defined the accounting structure go to the segments and as you can see I have already defined actually the different segments here as given in this slide the company and the value set is ideal company that we defined in the first step and similarly for all other segments uh, please make a note uh, this is one of the most important uh, important decision that you make uh, the, uh, the different segments how it is what is the sequence of uh, the different segments this is also a very important decision that you have to do before you define the KF for the accounting structure so once we are done with the segment definition of the, the accounting structure KF we attach the value sets also as you can see here that concludes that completes basically the chart of account setup the final step is to define the values for these value sets so i will show you for one value set that is ipl company and similarly all other segments you have to define the values for them now for that we have to go to the flex value set values screen Let's select here Let's give the actual company and and you, as you can see I have given already I have already defined one value 0 1 uh, with the description IPL enter. so this is one of the values of for the company similarly you define all other values for this value set as well as other value sets so that's pretty much of it for uh, with uh, basically setting our chart of accounts this concludes and it's ready to be attached to a set of books thank you